Hey everyone, it's your guy, the Urban Window Farmer. Today's episode, I'm going to give you guys an update on the Martian Tower Garden. And what I'm also going to do is I'm going to harvest some lettuce. And there's one thing I need to mention that I've noticed. So there's two methods. One method is um, adding seeds to the Martian Tower Garden directly. And the other method is using an LED germination tray. Um, in this case, I'm using a Spider Farmer LED light. I've noticed that the seedlings that were under the LED germination tray, um, when they become full plants, the plants become much fuller, um, much larger, uh, look much more healthy, uh, less issues with the plants, less um, than when I germinate them in the tower itself. Also look at this chart right here. Um, some plants have very low and some plants have very high to extremely high respiration rates. Respiration rates kind of tell you how much nutrients are lost after a plant has been harvested. And lettuce is one of the ones that has a, a fairly high respiration rate, so it's much better to eat your lettuce as fresh as possible. Another benefit of having a Martian Tower garden or having a garden, any other kind of garden, so, you can, so that you can harvest and eat your lettuce as fresh as possible. And that's what I'm gonna do now. This is a red velvet lettuce plant. And the reason why I harvested this one, um, it was being shaded by a mustard green. And I felt like it's, it's a good enough size to go ahead and harvest. Red velvet lettuce produces very dark, maroon to greenish bronze colored leaves. They have a very nice chewy texture. Alright, so next, I'm going to clean up this plant a little bit, so I usually like to remove some of the outer leaves that are a little bit older, um, that I don't particularly want to eat, and also I'm going to remove the net pot and the roots. So as you can see there, there's one of the older leaves that I'm pulling away, I'm going to get my handy scissors and cut away at some of this that I don't want to eat. Oh, never mind, it just pulls right off. A couple more of these old dead leaves. And like most of these lettuce plants, you know, the new leaves are in the middle and the older leaves are on the outside. Um, so pull it away from the neck cup and all I'm going to do here is just cut it away from the stem and I'm going to wash the plant. Um, I'm not sure if I actually have to wash it or not, but I just do it because it's easy to do. So I went ahead and rinsed the, the uh, plant, the lettuce plant off in, in the strainer and I'm just going to go ahead and uh, put it in my centrifuge and remove the remaining water. So this nifty device right here uh, allows me to spin the lettuce and helps me to remove the rest of the water because no one wants um, lettuce that's all soaked with water. So go ahead and spin it, spin it, spin it. I think that's about good enough. And so the next step will be to, of course, dump out the remaining water. So I'm going to take this over to the sink, um, dump out the excess water, and then I'm going to give it one more spin, and the salad will be ready to go. All right, one more spin, and I'm just going to speed through this. So the next step is just make a salad. So I just wanted to show you guys how I harvest my red velvet lettuce plant. And if you do like this kind of content, please go ahead and hit the like button. And until next time, happy gardening.